What a run for OG's ladies this season. Both the soccer and basketball teams played for the state title. And now in head coach Vicki Doty's final season after 40 years of coaching the Titan Tracksters, the OG girls poised to perhaps add a second state crown to her resume. OG won the regional title. LB girls won their region as well. We'll begin with the girls 4 by 800 meter final. Division 2 action. Liberty Benton's Leah Wrecker. The anchor, they finished third. Her sales finishes 16th. Boys at 4 by 8 final, Ottawa Glandorf just missing out on the podium as they finish in ninth place, just over eight minutes. Prelims now, we'll start with the girls 100. Liberty Benz, Michaela Butler, a new Division II state record, 11.67 seconds. OG's Madison Steckschulte also qualifies for the final. Girls 4 by 2 first heat, Steckschulte as the anchor, leads the Lady Titans to the finals with a 149.89. They're seated third, Versailles just missing the finals. Boys 400, Van Wert, Keegan Hardman, second in his seat, fourth overall heading into the final. Teammate Quincy Salcedo, one spot short. Girls 4x4, Versailles, anchored by Camille Watron, gets the third place finish. LB finishing second, or sixth, I should say, second heat. Alyssa Ellerbrock anchoring the Lady Titans to a second place finish, third overall. Boys 4x4, Van Wert, Keegan Hardman anchoring a win in the heat time of 321.72. Heat 2, Elidas Clark, that's their big final leg, get the Bulldogs the fourth spot in the heat, advancing to the finals tomorrow. Girls 200, at Liberty Benz, Michaela Butler and OG's Madison Steckschulte finishing 1-2. A big hug afterwards, automatically putting them in a Saturday's final. As for Butler, fired up after smashing the state record by a full tenth of a second in the 100. It was amazing. Um, it was a little frustrating because there were two false starts, but it was absolutely amazing. I didn't think... That I ran that fast. So hopefully I'd like to defend my titles and then get the team on the podium. That'd be great. Let's go to the field. Half of the D2 field events today will begin in the boys' pole vault with Ottawa Glandorf's Colin Lobenthal clearing 13 feet 6 inches would finish in 13th place. Discus now. Banner to Alexis Dowdy. She'll be thrown at Ohio State next year. 112 feet. She finishes 14th. She'll be in the shot put. Tomorrow, staying in the discus, OG's Anna Bellman, 125 feet on this throw. She would finish in eighth place. Podium finish for the Titan. Out of the high jump now, Liberty Benton's Lindsey Bishop clearing 5-2. Freshman finishes fifth. Rest of the field events tomorrow morning down at Jesse Owens.